Okay everybody, once again I'm trying some more weird food! Because I'm apparently a culinary masochist or something. Anyway, um, <clears throat> I have... Today we're going to be trying Sidoral Mundet or Monday, depending on how that's pronounced. I think that's supposed to be a uh, apple flavored soda. This um, I wanted to try actually. It's non-alcoholic sangria, Sonorial. Um, fans of Homestar Runner take note for that. This is uh, Wonder Farm White Fungus Bird's Nest drink. Now I've already seen. Uh, Mike C. and Brad Jones both try this, and they both said it's bad, awful, horrible, so... Goody! Uh, chrysanthemum... Chrysan it's a flower tea drink. Chrysanthemum uh, by Eos. Uh, a couple of these I picked up in the uh, Asian food market. The bird's nest, the uh, chrysanthemum, and this one, which is peach flavor. Um, all aerated water. I don't have the word carbon in. Um, this is one of those cool uh, plastic, uh, like soda, like water bottles with the the soda top on it. So, um, first things first, I'm gonna get the glass empty. Well, it's somewhat empty. It's from the last. One. I'm gonna do the nastiest one first. Get ah, yeah. Go ahead and do this. Bird's nest. Now I'm shaking this up. Because that's something I didn't see anybody else ever do. So, and the lid of this is just the top. It's just dirty. Oh my goodness! So now I really want to drink it. That's all right. I'm gonna die. It'll be at the hands of a bird's nest drink. So, oh, there's some chunks. Now the cup still smells like root beer from that Sarsi drink I had, so... And there's chunks of things... Uh, already I'm kind of... I'm not going to tell you what that looks like. It just looks gross. Things I do for YouTube. And they don't give a dang thing back to me. Which is kind of sweet. The consistency is horrible. I'd have to like stick this in a blender for six weeks in order to get it to something I actually want to drink. But because that's, oh, I'm not. You really want to know what the consistency of this is? You, you try it yourself. I'm not going to say it. Now someone said it had bird spit in it. My actual birds' nests, but I don't see anything in here. It looks like something to be in a bird's nest. Maybe in a bird's egg. You know, it's weird. It's, it's, it's really sweet, and that's what's killing. So, anyway, let me finish this up because I need a glass. You know, if it wasn't for the consistency of it, that'd be all over that. Possibly. All right, let's reward myself with some chrysanthemum tea drink. Now, I, I, I'm a big fan of teas. Um, mostly I drink, you know, hot tea. Uh, tea or gray hot, actually. Um, with with milk and sugar. I've actually got hooked on that from, from the people in the UK. That does. And here's the thing, folks. I actually did watch, uh, you know, Mike's video. Mike did try this already. It's not mine. Must be urine. <laughs> it just looks like pee. Actually, you know what? Hold on a second. Jump cut. I just found a better glass to put that in. <laughs> I, 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 I don't. This is usually for soda. Let's put that whole thing in there. Missing the throffy top, but there you go. That's about as close as you're ever going to see to me drinking <laughs> on camera. Or at all, for that matter. Hmm. 
Those are pretty good. I think he's still got some of that goop from the bird's nest tea in there, or bird's nest in there, but it's not bad. <laughs> don't know why I just did that. Actually, about three nerds on the internet know why I did that, but that's besides the point. Anyway, let's try this apple, uh, <clears throat> apple soda, which I got from the dollar store, actually. Because, <laughs> you know, food from the dollar store, that's just, you know, that's FDA approved, definitely. So, anyway. Just like all the knockoff toys with copyrighted pictures of other products on it. That's, you know, it's in a clear bottle. I don't know why I'm showing it to you. It smells like sweet apple. It smells like those, like those apple pastries you get in like a vending machine or something like that. <clears throat> yeah. Enough smell it. Time to drink it. That just confused me. <laughs> Initially, you get this kind of like, kind of weird, sharp, bitter taste. But then, the more you keep it in your mouth, it's actually kind of like the aftertaste is great. I wish they would make that the forefront taste. <laughs> Maybe if I shake it up and come back to that later, uh, <clears throat> pardon, maybe that would be a good one. Then I'm going to try, this is, uh, this is peach, peach flavored water. Now, Mike tried a uh, green apple and he said it tastes just like eating an apple. So, I like peaches. Let's see uh, what that, this one tastes like. Oh, the smell. Oh, my goodness. If this didn't have sugar in it, I'd probably just keep it around just to smell it. Like an air freshener. Maybe when my Glade plug-in thing runs out, I'll wash it and put this in there and stick the, you know, see, see if that'll work. I don't know. Oh, my goodness. Man. What the heck did they put in this? Yeah, nutritional facts, that's fine. Good night. This is amazing. It's got, okay, well, you got water, fructose, corn, oh, just fructose. Not high fructose corn syrup. I'm so used to reading that because it tastes like butt. Um, carbonated dioxide, malic acid, citric acid, just chemicals. Peach flavor, sodium. Normally when you see stuff with like a lot of these chemicals in it, it tastes like you know, like how grape soda doesn't actually taste like grape juice or anything grape related whatsoever, but your mind knows it's grape. It's weird. You, you, you know, you would expect this to taste like peach soda, which tastes nothing like peach. Um, strawberry soda. This is really freaking good. Ooh. Might do another pint of that. Um, this, not, not time for a scenario today. On the plane, madam. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't seen Home Star Runner in a long time. What are you doing to me, chat brothers? You. I mean, I'm wearing your shirts. Come on, guys. I mean, I'm nobody famous on the internet, but come on. <laughs> anyway, sangria. From what I, from what little I know, is booze. Some kind of mixed fruity booze. I I don't know. I don't. I don't booze, so. It smells like sweet balsamic vinegar. Like really heavily sugared vinegar. Red wine vinegar or something. Balsamic, actually, is what it smells like. And that's exactly how it tastes. Oh my goodness, Bals oh. balsamic vinegar with water and sugar. Holy crap, why would anybody drink this? Oh, although I do have a strange 
urge to stand in line behind people and eat melty candy bars out of a questionable bag. I, I don't... Mm. Oh my goodness. That's just kind of growing on me now. Anyway. I'm at the end of the drink video, so you know what that means. Oh, but I don't have any more of that Sarsi left over because I drink it all. Um, and I don't have any more of this left over because I just drink that all too. So, let's just do the Mega Mix. Get it over with. Because we know that's what makes people smile is when gross crap happens and people want to actively vomit and some of this from the last video I did the uh, toasted coconut job wait a minute that was posted a whole week ago yeah but time travel is an awesome thing when you have editing or when you just wait to release things on the internet that looks Awful. Cheers. God. It don't smell bad. It smells more like that peach stuff, actually. Probably put more of that in than anything else. Anyway, enough stalling. Holy crap, that's good. <laughs> if you mix, mix enough bad drinks together, you actually turn out with something good. pretty good. It's tolerable. I'm getting only chunks of my drinks, but anyway, um, anyways, if you like this video, hit me on the slant. See you in the next one. I completely forgot. Uh, I was going to have one of these fudgy pops in the freezer. Anyways, so here, here's the, uh, the, the fudgy pop, uh, flavor ice thing, which is supposed to be Hershey flavored. So I'm thinking put, ew. What the smeg here goes. It's just not bad. Yeah, not bad. You can find them, go get them.